Sarah's lease? I gave her the key. Looks like she managed to break out of here, though. I hope she's okay. I'm sure she is. Yeah, she's shot me. But as tough as they come. But how did you know she is? Cow. Escaped? I was in contact with her by codec. Until I was tied up here, that is. Codec? Yes, she stole it from the guard. If she still has it, you should be able to contact her. I'm sure she still has it. What frequency was she at? Oh, yeah. Let me tell you, it's... Oh, yeah, I do actually know how to get the good and bad endings. It's, it's in the torture room, right, I think. Damn. You either submit or you, uh... You fucking bash the crap out of the fucking circle. On the back of the CD case. Try to contact her. I'll contact her right away. But tell me, if this doesn't work, is there some other way to prevent the missile launch? You need to find Hal Emmerich, one of my employees. Who's that? The team leader of the Metal Gear Rex project. A genius at engineering, but a little bit of an oddball. If there's anyone who can figure out how to stop Metal Gear from launching, it's him. What if he can't come up with anything? You'll have to destroy it. Emmerich knows how to destroy Metal Gear. Where is this Emmerich? Well, he's probably being held somewhere in the nuclear warhead storage building. It's north from here. That's where he worked. I understand, but why Metal Gear? The nuclear age ended with the turn of the millennium. Oh, you're wrong. The threat of nuclear war isn't gone. In fact, it's greater than it's ever been. Here we go, guys. Will it crash? Will it crash? Oh, sweet! Got it working. Is increasing even today. Listen, have you ever seen a warehouse? Sometimes this uh, FMV just doesn't want to load. Well, got it working, so sweet. Your waist stack this high, as far as you can see, because there's still no real way to dispose of the stuff. So they just close the lid and try to pretend like it'll go away? Uh, essentially, yes. And they're not even doing a good job of storing it. Many of the drums are corroded, with nuclear waste seeping out of them. Unbelievable. Not only that, but several pounds of muff are reported every day. <laughs> muff. It stands for material unaccounted for. It proves that there's a large and well-organized black market in nuclear materials. Furthermore, since the end of the Cold War, Russian nuclear engineers in particular are out of work with no way to turn. In other words, they're not getting enough muff, that's why. <laughs> making a bomb. We live in an age when any small country can have a nuclear weapons program. What about the other superpowers? Uh, Russia and China still maintain a significant nuclear presence. Complete nuclear disarmament is an impossibility. To maintain our own policy of deterrence, we need a weapon of overwhelming power. This game's filled with all sorts of innuendos and shit. You mean Metal Gear? Yes. You know our industry suffered quite a blow as a result of the cuts in military budgets due to this so-called peace. I remember hearing a lot about mergers and takeovers among the big weapons makers. Yes. And after my company lost their bid to produce the Air Force's next line of fighter jet, the Metal Gear system was our last ace in the hole. That's why we pushed to have Metal Gear developed as a black project. Black project? Oh my god, this guy's in about black projects as well. Fuck me. Pentagon's black budget. You can avoid a fucking black projects, black budgets, White House, fucking... No one can bother you. Enough Not of it. Even those bleeding heart liberals on the military oversight committee. Bribes. I prefer to think of it as good business. Anyway, Metal Gear was going to be formally adopted after the results of this exercise were analyzed. I don't give a crap about you and your company. Yes, that's about what I'd expect from a grunt like you. Here, th this is what you came for, right? What's that? An optical disc. Not an MO disc. The main hard drive was destroyed by gunfire. This is the only remaining copy of the data. What kind of data? All the data collected from this exercise. Don't play dumb. I know you were sent to get this. I hid it from that sadistic maniac while he was torturing me. They don't know this <coughs> disc exists. Excuse me? Make sure you report this to Jim. To your boss. I'll give you my card too. It'll open up all security level two doors. Is that name Jim again? Can you walk? Jim? No. Isn't that Colonel? Maybe the Colonel name's Jim. Who or what was that ninja thing? It looked like you knew something. That ninja? 
That was Foxhound's dark little secret. Dark little secret. An experimental genome soldier. <coughs> Jeez, cough in my face more. You know him. Cover your mouth. You should ask Dr. Naomi Hunter from Foxhound. She knows better than I. Naomi. You've got to stop them. If it goes public, my company and I are, are finished. What? Doesn't Metal Gear use currently existing technology? Metal Gear itself does, but... What? What did you do to me? Oh, no. Oh, no, it can't be. As a T-voice just broke out in again. Bastards. So, they, they actually went in. Did it. What are you talking about? They, they, they are just using you for... Seems like everyone's catching this T-Bar or shit. What's... Should you just kill him, Snake, just before they uh, actually turn? <laughs> I know it's not the T-Bar, guys. I'm just fucking joking around. Colonel, are you listening? Now he's dead too. I have no idea. Don't lie to me. It looked like another heart attack, but some kind of poison. Well, there are lots of drugs that can cause a heart attack in large doses. For example, potassium chloride or dioxides, but we won't be able to tell without doing an autopsy. Damn! Snake, I want you and Meryl to work together. Can I trust her? More than you can trust me. Yeah. Get in contact with her. Snake, there's a lot of electrical interference coming from there. It should be okay if you do burst transmission like us, but normal transmission is probably impossible. Try moving away from that area. Snake, get a hold of yourself. Naomi, what the hell was that ninja thing? A member of Foxhound? No. Are you sure? Yes, we have no one like that in our unit. Liar! Is that right? Snake, I'm counting on you. She definitely ha ha hiding something about that ninja. She knows something. I can smell it. Goodies! Yeah, got some soaking bullets and shit. Right, apparently uh, can't really call Meryl. At this location, I mean, look, look, it's like jammed and shit. Not jam like peanut butter and jam, but yeah. So I'm gonna call Meryl. Apparently, her number's uh, 15. I think it's 15. She better not be 15. She's supposed to be fucking old. And oh fuck! Didn't mean to do that shit. Ah, oh, one away. Get in there. Who are you? I was really impressed with the way you busted yourself out of there. The one from the prison? You're the colonel's niece. Meryl, right? No, it's not him. Oh god, I remember this fucking codec call. It goes on for fucking ever. I'm gonna have a smoke, guys. Enjoy the co uh, codec call. I don't need lectures. You're just like your uncle, you know? How do you know my uncle? We go way back. What's your name? My name's not important. Aha! Uh -huh. Could you be Snake? Are you Solid Snake? That's what some people call me. The legendary Solid Snake? You? Ooh, I wanna bang you! <laughs> Sorry, but before, I wasn't sure if you were one of the good guys. But I knew you were. How? It's your eyes. My eyes? They're not soldiers' eyes. And they're rookies' eyes, right? No, they're beautiful, compassionate eyes. Ah, oh, oh, come on, Snake. Fuck now. The legendary solid snake. You trying to sweep me off my feet? Don't worry. You'll land back on them once you meet me. The reality is no match for the legend, I'm afraid. Oh, I don't believe that. Why did you look so surprised when you saw my face? Because you look just like him. You mean the terrorist leader, Liquid Snake? Yeah. You know him? You're not brothers, are you? I have no family. So what's the deal, then? Who knows? Why don't you ask him? But first, I want some information. You were involved in this exercise from the beginning. What exactly happened here? I'm sorry. I was captured along with President Baker right after the terrorist attack. That's okay. But what is this place? I don't think it's just a nuclear weapons disposal facility. Boy, oh boy, it's just like them. Nobody told you anything, did they? Okay. You see, this place isn't really for disposing nuclear weapons. This base is owned and operated by a dummy corporation of arms tech. 
this is a civilian base? Right. For the development of Metal Gear. Colonel. Foxhound and the Next Generation Special Forces were called here for the test launching of a dummy nuclear warhead. Why Foxhound? Because they're a special ops group used to handling top secret missions. They figured they could help keep it all hush-hush. But we must have fired nuclear warheads before. Why just this time? I heard it was because this was to be a final test before the formal adoption of the Metal Gear program. Well, that's what I heard, anyway. Uh, sounds kind of fishy. So what do you think the terrorists want? Mm, sorry. I'm not sure. I was captured with President Baker right after the revolt started. Oh, yeah. That's when he gave you the detonation code override keys, right? That's right. Amazing you were able to keep him hidden from the guards. Well, women have more hiding places than men. Apparently they do. You met Baker, huh? How's he holding up? He's dead. What? Heart attack. Same as the DARPA chief. The chief died from a heart attack too? Yeah. Was either of them sick or anything? No, not that I heard of. Well, I don't believe in coincidences. Something funny's going on. Hmm. Sounds like it, but I have no idea what. Me neither. Yet. Do you know the person who designed Metal Gear? You mean Dr. Emmerich? Yes. Is he still alive? Probably. He should be in the research lab in the second floor basement of the nuclear warhead storage building to the north. Second floor basement? Yeah, that's where his lab is. I think they're forcing him to work on the nuclear launching program. So they'll need him alive until that's done anyway. Then we better do something before he finishes. You're right. In case we can't override the detonation code in time, I need to ask him how to destroy Metal Gear. You plan to take that thing on by yourself, Snake? It won't be the first time. Oh. What's the best way to get to the building where the doctor is being held? There's a cargo door on the first floor of this building that leads to the north. What's the security level of the door there? Five. But it's okay. I've got a level five card. Well, I've got to go save the doctor. You should go. I'm going with you. No way. You're no. Still too green. No oh, escorts for me. Somewhere. Snake didn't do that shit. Green. Oh yes, you are. You are green. Look at the codex. For just one second in front of your enemy, and it's all over. Good luck doesn't last forever. I don't know what happened. I just couldn't pull the trigger right away. I never had any problems in training, but when I thought about my bullets tearing through those soldiers' bodies, I, I hesitated. Shooting at targets and shooting at living, breathing people are different. Ever since I was a little girl. I always oh fuck me! Soldier. Go on with your fucking love story. Jeez. Train my mind and body for the one day when I could finally see some real action. And now. So what now? You want to quit? I can't quit. I can't allow myself to quit now. Listen, Meryl. Everybody feels sick the first time they kill someone. Unfortunately, killing is one of those things that gets easier the more you do it. In a war. All of mankind's worst emotions, worst traits, come out. It's easy to forget what a sin is in the middle of a battlefield. But this isn't a war. It's a terrorist action. You're just a little jumpy from the combat high. The adrenaline in your bloodstream is starting to thin out. Just take it easy. But I learned all about combat high at the academy. We'll talk about it later. For now, just think about keeping yourself alive. If I get out of here alive, I'll think about that other stuff. Okay. Let me try to say this another way. Stay the hell out of my way. Yeah. <laughs> You're a real bastard. Yeah, that's what my uncle said. Huh. Fucking I told you. The real me is no Colonel talking behind my back and shit. <laughs> it looks like you were right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I have a little okay, giggle. Snake. I'll be a good girl. We'll link up after I grab the doctor. Then we'll take care of the detonation code override. Gotcha. But listen, I know this area better than you. Call me if you have any questions. Be careful, okay? After I open up the cargo door, I'll contact you. Right. So, I'm in the middle of a smoke, guys, so... Hang on a minute. Oh, well, I picked up the wrong controller. Hang on a minute, what's going on? Has he gone out the window again? No, no, don't fucking call her again. Jeez, I already fucking listened to it. Go away. Right. Oh, some guys are here now. Got some cigs. Have a little smoke with the old snake. There we go. Not too long. 
got a couple of drugs left on this thing. So, really enjoying.